Hey everybody, this is Whiskey T. I'm headed out to scout some public land over here by Keystone Lake for hunting. And uh, I got my bow with me and my camo with me. So, because the season's already open, I'm just gonna mostly scout today, but if I see anything that I can legally shoot with my license, hunting license, um, I just want to have that option if I see something that I could legally kill and take home and tag it, that way I'll be ready for that. I won't have to hike out to my truck, get my gear, and then head back in. This is part of cow skin right here, public land for hunting. We're gonna go check this out real quick. In the last video, I was down there on the other side of this property. I walked around that side. now we got a ton of rain and Keystone Lake out there in the distance was flooded really really bad I mean there were roads underwater that are usually a good half mile away from the lake and I think the water level got up to somewhere in here where I am, over here. But since it wasn't hunting season, or it wasn't just before hunting season, I didn't even walk through here. Looks like something's been going through there. I really wish this was dirt or mud instead of concrete I'm walking on. Something looks like short, probably coyotes been going through there. To give you a general idea of where I was. See that truck way over there in the distance? To the left of that, about a hundred yards to where the hunting land public hunting land starts over there I did a video on that and I'm just in here checking this out it is faux season but chances of me finding a deer today are not as good as probably Tuesday this coming week. Today is October 7th in archery season. Oklahoma started on the 1st. This coming Tuesday, the weather is going to be a good drop in the temperatures from the 80s to, to down to the 60s. So 
so I'm just seeing what I can see. Hopefully I'll be able to head out to my friend's private property this Tuesday and hunt out there because his farm is not pressured like here. I already got permission to hunt there. I just need to schedule days with him because he's also hunting out there. That way he knows when I'm out there and when I'm not for safety purposes. Something's been back in there it looks like. It's all mashed down in a few spots. I'm just refreshing my memory. I've looked at all this on Google Maps but me, I prefer to see it too, that way I could get a better idea of where I could be if I do hunt this property. Just been too busy with work and haven't had a chance to get out here and actually walk around. Okay, right out there. Right out there, where all those birds are, way out there, and where that little point is, that's cow, that's cow skin east. It starts right there, and then it goes all the way around to that nuts that tallest bump on the horizon right there that's where cow skin east is but they don't they have some public hunting land over there it's just it's uh It doesn't seem to be quite as spread out as this to me though. You can tell this used to be a campground that's a picnic table. And then there's a barbecue right there next to it as well. <laughs> this all used to be a campground and then they turned this part into public hunting and part of that has always been public hunting over there as far back as I can remember. high and it's muddy. We've had rain this morning and a couple other days of rain this past week. That could be a little trail there. Land we walk through over there is those woods right in front of you. I come back over here to hunt I would rather be over there because I can't tell those few places in the grass the trails if it's uh, coyotes doing that or if it's deer I can't tell and of course we're walking on pavement so I can't go off the tracks I did find some deer tracks back in over there. So as of right now, I think I'd rather hunt that. Be out there early in the morning. 